Sorry, family, and welcome to Family Art Night. I'm Miss Gonzalez, and you are going to make me making some worry dolls with me that look kind of like this one. So what we're going to do first is we're going to talk about what is a worry doll and where does it come from? So I have my book called Silly Billy that in the very back, it talks all about worry dolls. So it says worry dolls, also known as trouble dolls, come from the Central American country of Guatemala. Some of you are probably from Guatemala, or you know somebody who's from Guatemala. Legend has it that the dolls were created by a young Mayan sister and brother whose mother, a weaver of beautiful cloths, had fallen ill and was unable to produce cloth to sell at the market. The children decided to use their mother's scraps to make tiny dolls. They then put them in pouches that they also made from all the scraps. The daughter is said to have told her worries to a few of the dolls, only to await the next morning with the feeling of being much less troubled. And when the children brought the dolls to the market the next day, they found a mysterious stranger with a tall hat who listened to the sister's story and he ended up buying all the dolls. According to the story, when the girl got home, she found the dolls from the night before and were in her pocket again, along with a note from the stranger instructing her to share one worry doll with each, one worry with each of her dolls before placing them under her pillow at night. And to this day, children in Guatemala often trust their worry dolls to make their worries go away while they sleep. So that's what we're making today. We're making worry dolls because sometimes we get a little worried about things that happen in our lives, things that happen at school, things that happen at home. But if we want to get those worries away, we can always use a little worry doll. So what we're going to do first is we're going to go ahead and we're going to read Silly Billy. So I'm going to go ahead and share my screen with you so that we can watch that video. Silly Billy by Anthony Brown. Billy used to be a bit of a warrior. He worried about many things. Billy worried about hats. And he worried about shoes. About shoes too? Hmm. Billy worried about clouds. And rain. Oh my, look at all the rain. Billy even worried about giant birds. Oh my. <laughs> His dad tried to help. Don't worry, lad, he said. None of those things could happen. Mm -mm. It's just your imagination. He was just imagining things. His mum tried too. Don't worry, love, she said. We won't let anything hurt you. But still, Billy worried. One night, he had to stay with his grandma. But Billy couldn't sleep. He was too worried. He always worried about staying at other people's houses. Billy felt a bit silly, but at last he got up and went to tell his grandma. Wow, fancy that, she said. You're not silly. When I was your age, I used to worry like that. I've got just the thing for you. She went into her room and came out holding something. These are worry dolls, she explained. Just tell each of them one of your worries and put them under your pillow. They'll do all the worrying for you while you sleep. Billy told all his worries to the worry dolls. He slept like a log. Oh, he had a good night's sleep. The next morning, Billy went home. That night, he again told all his worries to the dolls. 
he slept like a stone. The next night, Billy slept well. And the night after that, But the night after that, Billy started to worry. Oh no, not again. He couldn't stop thinking about the dolls. All those worries he'd given them. They must be so worried. It didn't seem fair. The next day, Billy had an idea. He spent all day working at the kitchen table. It was difficult work and at first he made lots of mistakes and had to start again many times. But finally, Billy produced something very special. I wonder what he made. Some worry dolls for the worry dolls. <laughs> That night, everyone slept well, Billy and all the worry dolls. <laughs> and after that, Billy didn't worry very much at all. And neither did his friends. Billy made worry dolls for all of them. All right. I love that story of Silly Billy. It's so funny that he worries about such random things. And I know sometimes in your brain, sometimes you think about things and you worry so much. So today we're going to make worry dolls. So can you go ahead and take out your materials? So you're going to need your clothespin, a pipe cleaner. I think we gave you a big one. So if you need to cut it, go ahead and cut it so that it's a little bit smaller. These are going to be the arms of your worry doll. And then you'll have your string. You've got different color strings. So you go ahead and pick what colors you're gonna make. You can make your shirt, the pants, it could be all together. It could be a dress. It could be a skirt. It could be shorts. You're gonna be able to pick it. So let me show you what you're gonna do to start it. So here's my clothespin and I'm gonna put my pipe cleaner behind it. And all I'm gonna do is wrap it around. You see how I have it wrapped around right now? And I'm going to twist one, two. So it looks like this now. And then I'm going to just put its arms out. Just like that. See? So there's his arms. And, we, and if you need to twist it a little bit, you can twist it. So you make sure that the hands are where the feet are. So you can twist it a little bit. Just like that. And if one arm is bigger than the other, you can always cut it a little bit. Or you can just leave it like that. No big deal. So what I want for my worry doll is I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna make an orange shirt for it. So the way you start is you're gonna get the end of the string and all I'm gonna do is put my thumb on it. You see how I have my thumb there? And I'm just gonna start wrapping it round and round. I'm gonna go around the pipe cleaners, but I'm gonna go round and round. Do you see how it's starting to go round and round? I'm gonna go around the pipe cleaner, go around the bottom and under it. Okay, and then once you're ready, if you have it kind of separated like this, it's okay. All you have to do is make sure you hold onto the string and with your fingers, just move it on up, just scoot it up and it'll go right up. You can go slowly at first to make sure you're doing it right. Just push, push, push. See, just like that. And another way that you can do it too, is if you wanna hold onto the string and you just wanna make your clothespin go round and round, you could do it that way too. So that's another way you can do it. Okay, so that you can make all of it shirt and I'm gonna just move it on up and keep going and going. Okay. Now, once you get to the leg area, right? Where the waist is, then you get to decide how do you wanna make um, the bottom part. Do you want to make it a full dress? Like if I want to make my worry doll with an orange dress, I'm probably just going to put all the way orange all the way down to here to show that it's a dress. Or if I want it to be pants, then what I'm going to do, here, let me show you, is I'm going to go between the legs to separate them. Because if you put them all together, it's kind of going to be like a skirt. 
or like a or like a dress. See, so if I go like this, right? You see that? If I wrap it around like that, it's gonna be like a dress. But if I want pants, then I need to go through the middle of it. You see how I go in the middle and go around? Okay. Here we go. This part is a little bit trickier. You gotta kind of go slowly to make sure you get on each side. You see that? Okay. So there's your worry dolls. And when you're all done, I can't wait to see what you come up with. And don't forget to give your little doll a little face. Don't forget to give it some little eyes, maybe a little mouth. Maybe you want it to be worried. You're going to make a face like this. Oh. Or maybe you're going to make it just smile. Okay, so you go ahead and you make your worry dolls. And if you want to finish it up and then come and show me, I'm in room K2. So you can come by and show me. Hope you had fun making worry dolls with me. Bye-bye. <laughs>